Welcome to this video guys. Let's see how we can quickly push our website to GitHub and make it public. So I have this website here and let's check what it is first. And this is a simple website here about boxing and this is just a template that I downloaded. So yeah, and let's push it to GitHub and see how we can make it public. So first let's go to GitHub itself, right? And I'll create a new repository. If you already have a repository, this will work with that too. I'll just call it Boxer website and I'll leave it to public and click on create repository. So now we have our repository ready. So we just need to push that code here and then do some stuff here in GitHub pages to make it public. First, you need to copy this. Okay, so I'll just copy this URL here and go back to my project here locally and create a local Git repository here. So open command prompt in this directory. So as you can see, I am inside my project folder here and initialize a local Git repository. I'll add everything to tracking and I'll add a first commit message and say working. Okay, and now let's add a remote repository that we copied from there. And now we need to check our branch, right? So we only have master branch by default in GitHub by default here. So as you can see, they're pushing to main branch. But in our local, we have the master branch. So what we do is we first check out to a new branch and call it main. And then we just push it to GitHub. Okay, it is now pushing to GitHub because we have added a repository link here. And once this is done, we can make it public. Okay, so it is pushed now. So let's go back to GitHub and let's refresh this page and you'll be able to see the content of the website. Here we are. All right, now just click on settings here, click on pages and here in your branch section, click a branch here. So we only have a main branch. If you have multiple branches where you have different features, you can just switch to any of the branch that you want. So I'll click on main and just click on save. So now as you can see, it is showing the message GitHub page source saved. Now it will take a while to deploy your website. So I'll just refresh this. Okay, let's see if it is done or not. So it's not complete yet. So after it is complete, you'll see a message here and you'll see a URL here, which will be hosting the website. So let's wait for a few minutes. So it probably took around a minute. And as you can see, now I refresh it and I'm seeing this message, your site is live at this. So you can just click on this. And as you can see, the website is live here. Now you can copy this URL and share it with your friends and send it to whoever you want. And your website is now live. So this is how you can easily deploy a website to GitHub. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.